All right. So one of the last things we'll talk about um, in the basic LaTeX lessons here is how to insert images into your document. Um, particularly for mathematics, you probably want to insert uh, lots of graphs and diagrams and so on into the document. Um, the comments, again, pretty much summarize everything. You want to use the .png image format whenever possible. Uh, JPEG will work sometimes, GIF will sometimes work, but .png tends to work the best, um, or at least the most reliably on my Windows systems that I've used. And then you want to save the image that you want to put into your document in the same folder as your .tex file. So here's the um, folder that contains this image. I've got a you know a LaTeX folder and then less than 10 images. And then here's the tech file that I'm editing right now. And in that same folder is the actual graph that I want to insert into my document. Okay. And then here's how we go about doing it. Once, you're, once you've got that, once you've got the PNG, and once you've got the, um, that image saved in the same folder, the command is pretty simple. Uh, I-N-C-L-U-D-E, include graphics, curly braces, graph.png. That's the name of the folder, uh, the name of the file, graph.png. And I will typeset this. And it's going to run. And there it is. There's the image. Now I can, you know, put text around it if I want. Uh, here is a graph of the function. This is f of x y equals sine of. Uh, this is sine of square root x squared plus y squared. That's the actual function that it is, and uh, typeset it. And now you'll notice that the image is obviously coming off the page. Um, how can I center this thing and make it look nice? Very easy. Begin center and center around the image. And there it is. Now I may want to make the image a little bit smaller or a little bit larger, so I'll put in square braces um, scale equals maybe 0 0.75, make it a little bit smaller, and press typeset, and my image will shrink a bit. That looks pretty good. Uh, I can, of course, reduce it even farther if I want, 0 0.50. That might be a bit too tiny. Yeah. So 0.75 looks pretty good. And, of course, if I leave scale at 1, it'll just be the, the default size, but I think 0 0.75 looks pretty good. And that's it. That's how you uh, insert images. Hope this was helpful.